Hello and welcome to another video. In this video, we do. Um, we're going to show you. I'm going to show you the second part to how to create a talk on Spoon. So I have found an image. Actually, I created this image. Um, I found a background. I edited the words. I changed the font. I edited the colors, the gradients, a whole bunch of things. So it is now ready to be posted on Spoon in the talk section. And basically, this can be transferred to other parts of Spoon as well. Um, but specifically, let's talk about the talk section. Right. So now I posted this. Notice that you can do a one to one ratio, uh, three to four, uh, original. Uh, two sorry three by two and sixteen by nine. So I'm going to use the original, and you can always cause resize it. So if you want to focus on something, uh, like this, you just have to play around with it. Um, that's the best way to learn. And so I have actually made this perfect perfect size. So if I shrink this down to size and I just do this, it would, um, it's kind of not exactly straight right now. It's you have to just you know play around with it a bit make sure that everything is perfect like this this is perfect if you can see this um maybe you're watching this on your computer not your phone so this is the exact dimensions for the original it is um it is hd my, my graphic is hd the words everything is hd meaning it's like 1080 by uh 1920 right that's the dimensions so it's kind of like 16 to 9 but not really is i mean 16 to 9 but 9 to 16 sorry that's how it should be anyway those are all the different details that you may not necessarily need to know just know that you can do one to one three to four original three to two and 16 to nine sorry i, I actually you know um anyway those are ratios i know i said it wrongly i'm sorry i have had a long day right so so this is basically what you do you find the image and you can crop it as well you can also um do a few other but a few buttons at the bottom this crop there's the undo button and then there's the other button which i don't usually use uh, let me check what it is okay so this is a scale so you can actually scale things yes that's correct. i don't usually use this um but it's also helpful i guess and a crop button again um you can do the you can put your finger uh and do the do your skill and you should just let it go it goes back to 87 because that's the uh default settings that i usually use anyway you can choose different uh you can use different settings if you want again just you know uh try different things and um and you you learn by 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 doing things right by doing this so i like this and i'm going to actually x out because i already did the background so i'm going to but usually you will press the check mark on the top um right side but in this case i'm just going to close this and cancel this so that it doesn't affect any changes even though it's exactly the same dimensions so i'm just going to cancel that and so you see this is what shows up once i have done what i need to do and notice i can also type a message here i can also say uh um i guess hello yeah right with, with three l's <laughs> uh and then you can obviously one of the tricks actually is to move this to up so you can actually move things around right you can move it there's a, there's a limit if you must no, there is a limit, right? So you can do that, or you can also like, um, I mean, just move it all the way down, delete, 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 and then by this one here, then just make sure that you say hello, and then you can just move it all the way down as well. And there's a limit, see, cannot input any more text, even though it's not characters, it's just text. So you press done, and it's right there, so it's right above live, right? I'm just going to delete this because i don't need to and you don't really need to actually put anything in this section oops cancel so you don't need to type anything just uh i just say done and then uh again you got to put a title so what does so i think about i read this question many times and i think about a suitable title um 
how does language affect how you view the world we live in? So, uh, so I guess row, right? Language, just. I like to usually ask a question. That's how I do it. So, you have a limit, um, character limit of twenty, and so you need to have. 20 characters, including spaces and punctuation. Meaning the question mark is also a character, right? So, um, right, I'm going to click OK and tap OK. In this case, again, if you do this, if you enter any background image, the background image will disappear and it'll be replaced by a gradient. It's just so you know that. I'm not going to do that right now. I'm just saying. And again, try it. Try different things and eventually you'll figure things out. Um, of, also, you need to customize the picture to your phone. It may look different on dif different phones. I have not tested that. I only use my phone and this is the dimensions that I've used. Uh, but feel free to try out different things and look at look at the talk on different phones. And so you know and, you know, um, have a good understanding of the nuances to that. And so we have done the characters. The if you type, uh, tap on the T, um basically there's nothing right now because i have no message gradient we're not going to do that and uh images again you can in my case i can use the gallery or photos and i've really done that and you make sure you add a title you can leave that blank also but i think it's best if you don't if you can think of a good title that is 20 characters or less put a title that really helps. That's one of the tips I'm going to give you. And um, let's see. There's other options here. Let me check. So, yeah. Hide after 24 hours. Hide from profile. Right? So, sometimes you want to make it anonymous. Um, so, people cannot see that, you know, this content is in your profile. Also, you can hide certain things after 24 hours. So, I'm just going to leave it as it is. And I'm going to actually post it right now. And so once you tap on post, it's going to ask you, are you sure? Basically, it's going to remind you it's against the terms of service to stream on, to, to, sorry, to stream copyrighted material. And so you can cancel. And then if you do, if you have if you have some copyright material, and it is uh, potentially. Um, um, you know, it, it's potentially um, possible that you would get flagged for it, then you should click cancel and remove any copyright material. Um, and I don't have anything like that. So I'm just going to tap OK. And it's going to be posted. See, it's going to do that. And then it's going to say posted. So now the post, the talk has been posted. <laughs> and you can see on top it says row of languages and then my username dear daniel and then diamond and you can see the twin towers and the background image and the question is how does language affect how you view the world we live in sometimes unfortunately i do have typos in this case i don't as far as i know the grammar is fine everything is fine it's good to always proofread your stuff um but that's really on you and uh, if you do see any of my spelling mistakes or any grammar mistakes, please forgive me. Um, I am a kind of professionist that way. Anyway, so this is basically how you post. And when you tap on this, it shows, you know, you can record the first comment. And I do that sometimes to steer the conversation in certain directions if I choose. But in this case, I'm just going to let it be. And I'm going to see who responds in the next few minutes or seconds. And I'm going to just refresh this. You can't, you can't, you can't, you can't, you cannot just um, push down and refresh. You have to kind of go back to the main menu, right? And then um, refresh it that way. See, when you go press down, it refreshes. So right now, um, lots of new t talks. And um, if I go to my profile, then I will see my casts, which I... Okay, I, I did that. So, scene one is... Hmm, strange. Oh, okay. So, one is a cast, one is a live, right? 
Um, so that's why I use the image twice. But not to worry. And so I'm going to go do my talks. I'm going to take a look at this. And so this morning when I posted, good morning to you, right? Uh, I have 13 comments. These are all the comments. And again, a lot of people get a lot of love when they come and comment on. So if you want to get some love, comment on my talks. And then, um, this is nothing right now. And I have actually not talked or done any other like talks today. I've been really busy. Actually, I did a couple of lives today. I did two lives. And um, so I'm kind of exhausted in terms of um, speaking. So <laughs> I'm still doing this recording because it's a labor of love, right? So uh, I'm going to see who else responds. But for now, no one has responded. And you know, so let's go, you know, go home, refresh a bit. You know, look at this, look at this. And if no one responds, then no one responds. That's fine, right? Um, actually, I posted it earlier, but like I said, I did two lives and exhausted. All right, so that's it. This is it, basically it. And then once you do that, it is live, and you can tap tap on the three dots on the on the top. You can edit this, meaning you can only edit the the, the title, right? If you edit it, you can edit title, and there's character limit of twenty still. And I'm just gonna say okay, or I'm going to just like uh cancel that and you can also delete this but i don't recommend you deleting anything because um especially if people have responded you delete it everything is gone and it's gone forever so be careful when you delete things don't delete your talks unless there's something horrible um or you did something wrong you have to redo it if you have a typo somewhere on your you know message or question then by all means go ahead Hopefully before anyone responds, but once people start responding, um, try, try not to do that, right? Like I said, you lose everything and people get upset and they, they might not even respond to you next time. Um, so repercussions such as, this, such as that. Alright, so that concludes this video. It is a bit longer. I want to go through like the second part of everything as much as possible, as, if, if, as much detail. And I think I covered everything. Um, you, you know how to post, you know how to do all this stuff. Right, so hold and record again, cancel, um, and if you have any questions, let me know in the comments, and be sure to you know like, follow, be a fan, and comment. I love your comments, and I will respond to you as much as much as possible, and talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.